I'd like to comment on the fact that uh, in, 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 this current dec- in this current decade in which we're living, there's not been a lawsuit brought against uh, the redistricting plan that was put forward by the committee and approved by the entire legislature in 2011. You know, in the history of South Dakota, there have been a number of, of lawsuits that have been brought against uh, the state of South Dakota and the redistricting process because many people believe they were unfair to the Native Americans. Back in, in 2005, a lawsuit was brought against the state of South Dakota because uh, the plan that had been put forward by the legislature did not meet certain specifications uh, to protect the interests of Native Americans. And as a result of that, the state of South Dakota lost a million dollars. Because of that, in 2011, when the committee met to, um, to do, redo the lines based on the, on the census that was taken in 2010, the committee operated very, very cautiously and very, very precisely to make sure that the Native American populations that live primarily uh, in, uh, in uh, Oglala, Lakota County and in Todd County, that these, the interests of them would be protected and that they would, it would meet the specifications of the uh, Obama Justice Department. The ACLU, uh, representatives of the ACLU were in every, uh, came to every committee meeting that was held and their, their attorneys were in the, in the hearings when uh, public testimony was taken. And as a result of that, uh, uh, and as a result of the fact that the map was approved by the Obama Justice Department, uh, in this la- in this, during this, this decade, there's been no lawsuit brought against the state of South Dakota because of the excellent good work of the committee to uh, protect the interests of Native Americans in districts 26, 27, and 28. No lawsuit has been brought uh, for one of the first times in, in, in South Dakota. And we're very grateful for that, and that's one of the reasons why we don't need uh, to redraw these lines as far as the state is concerned.